Right there, right there. Now look at that thing. That's truly one of the coolest tree frogs I've ever seen. That's the barking tree frog. Got your sun shining over here, and it's pouring down rain over here. Now there's one thing about this weather that I do love, and that's the fact that all the different reptiles and amphibians are gonna come out now that we got this rain. So if I get up here a little ways, I think we're gonna beat the rain. I think it's gonna stop just up here, right there. Oh, it's definitely stopping. Okay, and that's it, we're out of the rain. That's how quick Florida weather is. It's raining one second, sun shining the next. I think it's an omen, we just saw a rainbow. All right guys, we're coming to the end of the road and as you can see, today might be our lucky day. Look at that. How often do you get to see something that beautiful? Look at these beautiful flowers. But that's not it. Okay, nice and easy. If you look right there on top of those leaves, there's a well camouflaged tree frog sitting right in plain sight. Now, I didn't see him until he moved, but now that I'm getting a good look at him, this is an endemic species, one I don't get to see very often. The barking tree frog. All right, let's get this guy a little bit closer to the camera so y'all can get a good look at him. He's one of the cuter species of tree frogs. Now, this is the largest native species of tree frog in the southeastern United States. The bullfrog is larger, and an invasive species known as the Cuban tree frog is also larger. Now, the way you identify this tree frog is those dark black spots on his back on a brightly green contrasting skin with a yellowish underbelly and white side markings. Also chubby in appearance, unlike some other tree frogs. Now these tree frogs are known to eat until they get so full they'll have to regurgitate some of their food. They have no limit. It's feast or famine for these guys. Like all amphibians, the barking tree frog relies heavily on water for reproduction and feeding. Now this is an endemic species, which means this species only exists in the southeastern United States. It is not invasive anywhere else and can only be found here. The barking tree frog is a very vocal tree frog. Now males have deeper voices as they get older and females select their mate based on the male's vocals. Now let's put this guy back where he belongs. Thanks for watching this episode. Please press that like button and subscribe. As soon as I hit a thousand subscribers, I got a special episode for everyone. I'm gonna do the cow killer challenge. That's where I'll induce a sting from the insect with the fourth most painful sting in the insect kingdom.